Oh, it's the best day ever, the best day that can be. It's the best day ever, the one for you and me. Oh! Guys and gals, friends and pals, welcome to another magnet mission. I am out at Cathedral Park. You can see the St. John's Bridge behind me. Uh, I don't know the history on it. It's really old and really beautiful, and so is this park. So anyhow, uh, we are going to get out here and do some magnet fishing at, uh, on the dock that I actually first started magnet fishing on. In fact, my very first time magnet fishing could have taken place here. I don't recall, uh, but I'll show you that in a minute. But our first point of order is getting these two 360 degree magnets separated. I'll show you what I'm talking about. So yeah, there's my Brute Boss 360 and my Kratos Titan, and they're just madly in love with each other. So we are going to use the uh, the uh, <laughs> railroad spike uh, and mallet technique. So shout out to uh, shout out to Scott at the Oregon Family Magnet Fishing. I think uh, we did a collab, and uh, sure enough, this this has happened to me before. Bad habit, but anyways, uh, we're gonna see what we can do here in just a minute. All right, let's see how it goes. <laughs> okay, it's pushing it off to one side, so that's good. Okay, we're getting warmer. Let's see if we can pull them apart. Okay, so far so good. We gotta be almost there. Ta-da! All right. Thanks, Scott. Oregon Family Magnet Fishing. Now we're gonna throw a magnet. All right, guys, just so you have your bearings, came down that ramp, and then this, this dock goes straight towards that big pillar there, which is under this magnificent bridge. And then we can go all along here and wind up over here. And I actually, uh, when I very first started off, I was dipping all along here and all along there and all along there. And I'm going to try some dipping right now. Uh, so I will probably just run up and excitedly show you finds as they happen. This is dipping, I think, uh, isn't the most... <laughs> it's like watching paint dry sometimes, you know? Well, here we go, though. All right. Hey, check this out, guys. That might be uh, salvageable. Really cool. Really cool crescent wrench right there. Cool, right on. Well, all right, we're off to a good start. Crescent wrench. Let's see what else we can come up with. Hopefully some good stuff. So here we go. Maybe something there. Yeah. Shout out to Monterey Magman shopping cart evidence. It might be on something, guys. I feel it's sliding off, though. Huh? Yeah, I think there's a shopping cart right down there. Not in a hurry to get that out of here because it's a kind of a pain right now. Nice little boat to Rooney. Well, I want to find more tools and whatever that heavy thing was. Oh, wait, what's here? Might be something here. I want something, guys. Nice and slow. Let's see if it comes up. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
Look how rusty that is. <laughs> this thing's falling apart. There we go. Big old piece of pipe. Should have worn my rain pants. There, let's bring you in a little closer. Since I've moved a little further away. cool guys check this out big industrial uh, uh, you know cartwheel so clearly I came off of a, a big heavy dolly or something I mean look at the mounting bracket on that thing so somebody meant business with that Oh, this thing's just disintegrating. I just pulled the uh, rusty, crunchy outer shell to reveal this soft, malleable inner part. Beard? Is it beard? Look, I framed my beard. Almost. Okay. Silly. All right, let's, let's try out here close up just for a minute. Let's see if you find anything in this region. Regional. Yeah, I feel like I'm on something there. That's... Yeah, okay. Oh, good. Hey, check it out. Boy, a handful. So here, look here. We got a... Uh, we got a fishing reel. And uh, some pliers. Well, now I don't want to leave because we found a crescent wrench just a minute ago. Well, a few minutes ago, but... Uh, yeah, okay. This is obviously crap now. Yeah, so I got to... <laughs> so far, the spot's treating me pretty good Why I move. I just like a change of scenery, because I can always come back and try it again. Oh, what's here? Piece of thin metal there, but that came up out of the muck. Okay, are we on something there? I'm just holding steady. I feel like the magnet's going to come off of whatever it is before it comes up. Sliding along. Oh, maybe. Nice and easy, guys. Oh, that guy's heavy. So, oh, look. It's a window ballast. I find these out at uh, Lake Sacagawea all the time. Here's one here. I wonder what the story of, of these is. How did these wind up in the river near docks? But that's a jumbo. <sighs> My goodness. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, that's a that's a good size one there. Window ballast. It's a little brisk out here today, but I love it. My, my hands, not so much. My fingers are kind of like, dude, I gotta get some waterproof gloves for this time of year. Might be helpful. All right. A leaf. And 
assorted shrapnel. Well, all right, here we go. Yeah, big old bent up nail right there. Say it. This guy, my my very first iPhone. Oh, it's the best day ever, the best day that can be. It's the best day ever, the one for you and me. Oh, it's the best day ever. That's why I'm so happy. It's the B-E-S-T-D-A-Y-E-V-E-R. Yippee! Yeah, I don't know if there's a SIM card in here. I don't know. Maybe I can uh, maybe I can find out what's on it and why it wound up out there. Hmm, rather suspicious. Yep, nothing notable here. Just a magnet full of shrap. Okay, uh, three more throws in this spot. If I don't find anything, we move. Anything notable. Hi. Thanks for coming. Okay. Nothing notable there. Changes everything? Will this be the moment in Magnum Mission history that changed the course of the channel? Actually, the channel's on a pretty good course. Oh, wait! Oh, wait, wait, wait! Okay, now it's nice. You know, this is pretty cool. That's just a little piece of pipe. But then we found uh, an, an industrial gas cap. So we're gonna try three more, right? I mean, that's pretty legit. I think tree limb again. scrap that's actually that's a solid chunk of steel right there so cool Chunk of steel. All right, guys. Yeah, digging it. Two solid chunks of steel in a row. Wait, wait a minute. These go to eleven. Yes. So the 
goodie bag might be a bit further out. some more cool chunkies here so it looks like a, a bracket for a, maybe a, a fence post and then we got check this out this is interesting we got this big bent up nail and then we got this little bent up nail but look how uh, look how they're almost identical like father like son right or daughter Anyhow, that's an interesting coincidence, isn't it? See there? Okay, I'm sure I showed you enough. No, look more! Do it! Stare into it forever! Oh, and I see our favorite... Uh, yeah, look at that uh, steel cable shrapnel in a big way. So let's be careful about that. So I don't know if you noticed my gloves are not in the best condition. I have better ones. I just grabbed these. It's fine. I am a trained professional. Actually, I'm not. I'm, I'm not monetized yet, so. <laughs> I'm close. <laughs> Do we? Ah. Uh, there you go. Got faked out. Got faked out by this renegade tree limb. It wants to be a piece. It identifies as a piece of metal, but yeah just just more nails and shrapnel this I might stay away from throwing quite so far this is interesting though look it's actually wire it's wrapped can you see how finely that's wrapped that's big shrapnel but look at how ugly it's making my magnet uh, I think we got something yeah what's this here oh all right Anybody recognize this? It's a, it looks like a transformer, right? And it's attached to this little hinge thing. So it looks like that was something that moved. Anyhow, cool. Testing, test. Is this thing on? Ladies and gentlemen, this guy is losing it. <laughs> Only a little. Last throw for here. Then we're gonna turn it around. We're gonna turn it around. Oh, really? Okay. Huh. So these might be two separate things. All right, though. I said last throw. This is a great spot to come back to though. Apparently there's a little, little honey hole here. But yeah, another big old chunk of solid steel right there, guys. <sighs> Love it. Wait, L? Let's see. No, that's J. L! Love it! I love it! Okay. I'm gonna move down, I'll be right back. You, got, you guys can't even see what's going on. I'm talking to air. All right. Here we go, come on. 
Come on. Quite a good size elderly person that lost this guy. It's a rebar candy cane. Merry Christmas. There we go. Someone lost the key, or did someone throw a key away because it was evidence? Let's try again. I can go to the exact same spot. It felt like a shopping cart or something big that's not going to let go if the magnet gets stuck. Oh, well, might have something here, guys. Here we go. Huh. So check this out. Boy, I wonder how old this is. It's bent, but look at how ornate the threads on that are. And then look at the head of it. A piece is broken off, but it's like a big old plus sign. It looks like, uh, you know, uh, some kind of symbol, some fancy symbol, but yeah, that's a pretty cool one, huh? something big right here guys something big right here yeah. it's a big old pipe it's a big old pipe a pipe that's big and full of soup tea. hello are you still there hello it's the back of my head it's the side of my head and face. Oh, come on now. There's some weight on there, but the line's moving strangely. Oh, oh. Hold on, guys. I thought it was something in a bag. Uh, some audio visual kind of thing. I don't know. I guess this will be our grand finale. Anyhow, uh, yeah, thank you so much. If you want a magnet of your own, Brute Magnetics, Kratos Magnets, there's links and descriptions and discount codes. Links and descriptions. There's links and discount codes in the description below. So uh, please like, subscribe, comment, and hit the notification bell. Thanks so much. I'll catch you on the next Magnet Mission.